As someone who isn't a gun nut, I've never been truly knowledgeable about many of the equipment used for firearms. However, over the years of playing FPS's, I have become familiar with many parts of them. One of the most notable ones being the silencer, also known as a suppressor, or a... a... a can. It is similar to how a car muffler reduces the noise of your car, and how a jet engine is specifically designed to reduce its sound output. But with how loud a gun can be and how simple the design of a suppressor looks on the outside, it must be questioned sometimes, how does a silencer suppress a gun? This is The Imponderable, where we answer the questions you've never asked. Now I want to start off by saying that the name silencer actually isn't even correct. Now yes, it is the official term for these metal cylinders, but when it comes down to it, it is almost impossible to truly silence a firearm. This is due to the fact that guns can make noises in three different ways. One of them being the mechanisms that make up the gun, such as the hammer, the other being the bullet that travels through the air at supersonic speeds, thus breaking the sound barrier, resulting in a cracking noise. And the other one is the muzzle blast, which is the shockwave that is produced from the gases as they exit the gun after the bullet is shot out. Now, while all of them can be reduced to some degree, it's unlikely that you're going to try and get all of them reduced at once to make your gun as quiet as possible. And if you are, I'm kind of concerned by that. But we're going to be focusing on the muzzle blast for this video because that's what the silencer is intended to reduce. Now, for those that don't know about suppressors very well, why are you watching this video? But if it does help, these things are screwed to the tip of a gun, or in some cases, such as the British Delisle Carbine, they're integrated within the gun when they're built. Now once you screw that big black cylinder into that little tiny hole, the magic is able to begin. Once the gun is fired, the gas shoots the bullet through the barrel as it normally would at the same exact speed. But when it reaches the silencer, there are hollow plates that divert its flow from making it to the end. And also, due to the fact that the silencer is about 20 to 30 times bigger than the barrel, the gas is able to expand and release some of its pressure that it had in the gun. Now the results of this depressurization can differ from gun to gun, but usually you'll lose range due to the fact that the bullet isn't traveling as fast as it was out of the barrel as it usually would without the silencer. There's also a common misconception that you lose accuracy and power when you use the silencer. Now this can be due to a couple of things. Accuracy may seem like it's being reduced due to the fact that the silencer is so big that it may block the iron sights of the gun. And my god, looking at that Uzi silencer, it seems like you could just beat someone to death with the thing. And when it comes to power, it may be because the fact that with a silencer, your recoil and muzzle flip are also reduced, thus giving the impression that you're getting less power out of the gun, when in actuality it's more because the gun is more stable with a silencer. And last but not least, the sound of the muzzle blast is reduced as well, and from what I could find, it's typically around a 20 decibel drop in sound. So with all that being said, how does a silencer- wait a minute. Only 20 decibels? So you mean to tell me that the difference between a Call of Duty gun's unsuppressed and sounds like a herd of elephants, meanwhile when it's suppressed it sounds so relaxing that you can make an ASMR video out of them, is just a difference of 20 decibels? Nope. Pop culture just exaggerates the amount of sound reduction a silencer does on a gun. The main point of the silencer is to reduce the noise of the muzzle blast to the point where it doesn't damage people's ears if they're around the gun. Outside of isolated incidents, silencers can't bring the noise of a muzzle blast down to a whisper. And it only gets harder the larger the ammo cartridge, such as the Giga Chad revolvers, which are so loud that it's almost impossible to bring it down to hearing safe levels they're so loud. So for all you up and coming mass shooters out there, just know that regardless of whether you have a suppressor or not, we'll completely hear your massacre. Oh, and get some help. So with all that being said, how does a silencer suppress a gun? Nah, screw all that. I'm still better than Call of Duty World War II. Silencers were exclusive to SMGs. Fuck Sledgehammer Games.